Turbulence is an unavoidable part of air travel. The National Center for Atmospheric Research reports that U.S. pilots encounter moderate turbulence 65,000 times and severe turbulence 5,500 times yearly. As climate change intensifies, turbulence is increasing, making in-flight safety measures more critical than ever. Turbulence occurs when a plane experiences sudden shifts in airflow due to jet streams, mountains, storms, or atmospheric instability. One of the most unpredictable types, clear air turbulence, CAT, strikes at high altitudes without warning, often in cloudless skies. Scientists believe climate change is accelerating the frequency and intensity of CAT, especially at cruising altitudes. Light turbulence is a brief, minor altitude shift, slight bumpiness. Moderate turbulence is stronger than light turbulence, but still manageable. Unsecured objects may move. Severe turbulence is an abrupt altitude change. Passengers are violently pushed against seatbelts. The plane may momentarily lose control. Extreme turbulence is the rarest and most dangerous, potentially causing structural damage and making control nearly impossible. To ensure smoother flights, airlines plan routes to avoid turbulence whenever possible. This may lead to longer flight times and increased fuel consumption. Pilots rely on pre-flight intelligence from air traffic control and reports from preceding flights. Onboard radar helps them adjust course in real time to avoid turbulent zones. While turbulence can be unsettling, severe turbulence is rare. There's less than a 1% chance of experiencing it. The safest defense keep your seatbelt fastened whenever seated. Most turbulence-related injuries happen to unbuckled passengers. Turbulence is a normal part of flying, but smart precautions ensure it remains just that, an inconvenience, not a danger. Air travel, flying is safe. The death risk per passenger boarding is now about 1 in 100 million. So relax, buckle up, and enjoy your flight.